Welcome back to Daily Pokemon Tekken. I'm playing a game called Pokemon Tournament DX. It's a Pokemon fighting game for the Nintendo Switch. And today I think I'm going to play with the... I can play Garchomp today. I've been playing Garchomp a little bit. Garchomp is a power type in this game, fourth generation Pokemon. Um, for Garchomp's support, I think I will run... I don't really have a preference when it comes to... Uh, I guess these supports. I guess I will go with Snivy and Lapras, since that seems to be a very well-rounded support. And for the cheer, I will just go with the special cheer. I'll just spend what I got when I got it. All right, and hopefully I learn some stuff. Okay, for this first round, we're fighting Yeppy. Yeppy's a Blaziken player that has been on Davy Pokken for a number of episodes. Uh, the Blaziken players are, um, they're good, and they tend to run me into the wall no matter what, uh, what character I run. Um, so I think we will use, we're gonna use Snivy, and I need to be careful of um, counter piercing attacks from Blaziken. Uh, I have been playing and I have been running into fewer players because more players are, whoops, let go of my shield while I talk. I've run into fewer players because Okay, there we go. Ouch. There we go, that works. There we go, that works. <laughs> I'm glad I figured that out. Now, I was saying that I was running, I've been running into fewer players. More people have been blocking me. I ran into a guy yesterday who, after I was about to win, he disconnected on me. And then I got a friend request from him. And the way the Nintendo Switch uh, friend and friend block system works is that the block button is like right underneath the add friend button. So he added me accidentally. And then when he realized that he went back and blocked it because when I exited to try and accept the friend request, I saw no request. Okay. Um, and now I really just run into the upper rank players and the occasional C or B rank player. What are you doing? Yep, he's kind of pressing buttons here. I don't know what he's uh, what his aim is, but I don't want to fall into his pace. Almost fell into his pace, so he's been like pressing buttons hard, and he ran through. It looks like probably 85, 90 percent of his HP. So I think maybe if I just hold my shield more, I can let him do all the work for me, and then land a good hit with Snivy or something. There we go. Whoops, he tagged me in the back. Ouch, a sky overcut. Okay. Nope, that doesn't work. Oh, I messed up. That would have been a that would have been a KO. I messed up. I accidentally converted into the grab. But that hits, and I think that will be a KO. Maybe. Yep, that's it. All right, that's the KO we're looking for. So for this one, my opponent pressed a lot of buttons. They pressed a lot of buttons, expecting me to. Uh, be more reactive than I was. And I was falling into the pace for a little bit, but I cleaned it up, I think. But we'll see what the second and third matches have to bring. Okay, here we have a Pikachu Libre player. 
Name 22? I don't think I have run into this person before. Their location says they're from Japan. So, mm, I don't know. Uh, Pikachu Libre is a grappler, but I, I don't really know how the Garchomp Pikachu Libre matchup is. So, I'll just go what comes naturally. I'm not at a point where I know Garchomp's combos. I'm still, still figuring out my buttons, but Garchomp feels... Garchomp feels good. I look like a grab that Pikachu Libre was trying to hit me with. I kind of want to keep at mid-range in case Pikachu Libre tries to hit me with, um, in case she tries to grab me. Ouch. I don't know if that was wild charge or not. That's a good counter. Hmm. Okay, she's gonna back off. Oh. I was a little late on that kick, I think. Let's just run away. There we go. Oh, not quite. Yeah. Back up. Good counterattack. Garchomp seems to be very fast. Garchomp has a very fast run speed. I probably think maybe it's second to maybe only Darkrai. Not terribly certain yet, but very fast. He recovers very quickly out of his aerials. Um, I'm thinking, let's, let's stick with Lapras. The plane isn't broken. I'm kind of impressed with Garchomp. Garchomp is, uh, I think he's considered a rushdown character. Let's just get away from this. Ah, it clashed with my projectile. I know Pikachu Libre has a... Ah, I should have let it go. Yeah, I don't, I don't really want to take my chances on this thing because she could wake up with a counterattack. So that's why I'm hesitant about like converting it to a grab. And I don't want to keep doing jump-ins. Ah! I don't want to do jump-ins, otherwise it will get too predictable, I think. So we might just be better to just hang back and block until she does something. Yeah, I wasn't ready for the grab. I had a feeling it was going to eventually come out because she hasn't done it all game, so now she's done it twice. Uh, I have to go into my burst. Can't just let her run me over. Ah, she tried it a third time. Yep, she tried to just walk up and grab a third time. So that seems to be what they're going to go for since they know I'm, a, I'm patient. <laughs> oh my goodness. Very slow, very slow. Ah, there we go. There we go. I'm liking him. I'm liking him. He's got a lot of power behind his attacks. Very good. Fundamentals seem to be carrying me very nicely here. Well, uh, we'll do one more. Okay, so for our last fight, we're fighting a Japanese Shadow Mewtwo player. I might have played this person before. I cannot remember. The, the sprite with the mask makes me think I've uh, I've played them before. So at the time of this recording, I got to or I need to uh, edit this, and then I guess I'll have to record some more Pokemon later today to spread out because I'm going to spend those that time. Let's go with Snivy. I'm going to spend that time editing my Sonic Frontiers and Armored Core uh, Project Phantasma so that I can have those cleared out when the time. Um, of course, six drops. Uh, I feel like I feel like Garchomp's moves. Ah. 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 I should have just followed through. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have stopped it after the second time. Ah. Just hold shield. Back up. 
Back up. Woo! Jeez. <laughs> Feels good. He feels good, man. Um, and like he feels he feels fair. Like as long as you're not running into somebody that is throwing off like a bunch of projectiles, then you have to like walk and block your way in, or like you can like test out dig to try and get over to your opponent. Um, but like those dash combos that you see a lot of the higher rank Garchomps do. Yeah. Wow, he covered he covered that grab. He blocked really quickly. Let me. He's jumping into the air a lot. He got behind me. It doesn't work. Maybe we can... Ah! I tried to go for Stone Edge. I was a little late on it. Stone Edge is not frame one. Okay. What's he afraid of? Uh... Throughout Snivy. There we go. Hold shield. Should we go? Whoa! What'd you what you drop your shield for? <laughs> you can't drop your shield like that. It's not like your Gengar. Okay. Well, that's a win. My opponent dropped the shield. Uh, that's been Daily Pokemon Tekken. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next part. You guys take care.